Hi, let's see how to fix the held device to server request failure error code 51503. So, are you trying to encounter the frustrating message server request failure error code 51503 while trying to play the held device 2? If so, you're not alone. This error can be hindrance to enjoying the game, but fear not, there are several potential solutions to this issue that you can try. So let's see how to fix the hell divers to server request failed error code 51503. The first method is restart the hell divers to restarting the hell divers to can resolve the temporary connectivity issues or the glitches that might be causing the server request failed error code 51503. This process refreshes the game connection to the server and can often clear up the error without further action needed. Whether it can be for the PC, for the PlayStation, close the game by clicking on the X on the top right of the window or using all the press F4. If the game is unresponsive, use the task manager, select the Helldivers 2 and click on end task. Relearn the Helldivers 2 through Steam or the desktop shortcut. For PlayStation 5, exit the game by pressing the PS button. Highlight the Helldivers 2, press the option button on the other controller. Select Close Game from the menu. The second method is restart the Steam and your PC. This error occurs in the Helldivers 2 is often related to the server issues, which can sometimes be resolved by simple restart of the Steam client or and the computer. Okay, so you can also restart by your system by going to this start button click on this particular power button and click on restart so once you click on restart your system gets restarted the third method is run file divers 2 as an administrator running the head divers 2 with the administrative privileges ensures that the game has all the necessary permissions to communicate effectively with its servers which can prevent the errors like 51503 from occurring Right click on the head device to execute our file or the shortcut. Select properties from the context menu, navigate to the compatibility tab, check the box that says run this program as an administrator. Click apply and then OK. Launch head device to check if there are persists. The fourth method is uninstall and reinstall the head device to. Some of the simple steps what you can do is that you can just uninstall the head device to application and then again you can reinstall it by downloading from where you downloaded previously whether it can be from the official website google play store or from the app store okay so you can also apply this for your pc or for the playstation the fifth method is contact the hand to technical support team if you have tried all other troubleshooting methods and if you're still facing the problem you can contact the hand to support team it's the website arrowhead .com. Okay, so here you can raise the ticket and here by clicking on this particular option, submit a request. So the backend technical team they will get back to and they will resolve your issues. Okay, so that's all about this. Thank you.